Oh yeah, I'm great to be back, man. It's, it's feeling, I'm feeling different here, and everything's going a little different. I'm looking at it at a different way, and just mentally getting right for the for, uh, spring ball and all that, and just preparing. You know. Do you still feel like you gained a lot from being here in, in August? You know, in practicing with the team throughout fall. Yeah, definitely, I gained a lot because I know most of the playbook, but I'm still looking at it and learning all the other positions right now. So yeah, I know a lot about the offense and the, and the school and how coaches work. So yeah. When you got back, did you talk to Lane at all? Have a meeting with him, impromptu kind of thing? What did you guys talk about if you did? Yeah, I mean, we just talked about going, doing everything the right way, and just getting the best out, making, making the best of this, and doing everything the right way. Uh, Devon Flournoy, a couple of years ago, he, I guess in 08, he played his first freshman year, played a little bit, and then redshirted his sophomore year. Is that something that, because you, you obviously didn't redshirt last year, is that an option for you? Have you? Uh, no, nah, that's not. I mean, it could be, but no, nah, I'm not looking at that. Mm -hmm. I never even thought about it. So. So. With with Kyle out for maybe half or so of spring practice, this is kind of I mean, you, Brandon's time to shine. Do you think you can kind of impress the coaches in spring and first couple, you know, maybe five or so practices and impress them? Maybe you can start a split I mean, or put yourself in the mix there? Yeah, definitely. I mean, that's what I'm looking to do, and I'm preparing off the field to do that. So when spring ball gets here, we'll see. Having come in here in August, basically the same time as Robert, you know, going through all the same things, what did you, what can you see that he did so effectively? You know, he basically put his, put himself on the map nationally with one season. What did he do that was, you know, so good? Uh, I guess he just listened to the coaches and did everything they do and just worked hard. And, and he uh, showed them something that, that put him on the field and gave him an opportunity to do all that. Obviously, you and Kyle are close. I mean, then, he, you know, like we said, he went down. Was that tough for him? Did he, you know, he talked to you about that at all? I mean, I mean, it was tough for him, but Kyle's a, He's a good dude, and uh, he always, he's mentally, he got mentally right in his head, so like, he'll be back and he'll be ready to go whenever he come back. Did you, did you have to skip any classes last semester, or how did it work? Are you back? Uh, no, nah, I finished, I was still going to class even though I was on the team, okay. and I finished semester, so I'm, I'm good with school.